Hi guys, picked this up in a charity shop. Just taking the cover off, I can see it needs AAA batteries. So I'll go and have a look, see if I've got any. I think this one's infrared control, but I'm not sure. That looks like an infrared sensor on the back. But that looks like there might be one at the front as well. It might just be um, object avoidance. We'll find out. Well, I've put fresh batteries in them, and I've just tried him with a ordinary TV remote, and it's not responding to that. So I guess I'm going to have to go and get some of my proper infrared controls. Well, there we go. I've tried all those infrared controllers, and none of them talk to him, which is why I keep saying, don't buy infrared control toys unless they've got the transmitter with them. So, we'll have to take it apart at some time, won't we? I'll just put it in the box for now, but we'll take it apart at some time and see what we can do with it. On the other hand, I might as well take it apart now, hadn't I? I've got a screwdriver handy. I'll have to go up and get my meter just to check the power is getting through to the receiver. There we go. Well, looks like we've got detectors at both ends. Okay, first thing to do, see if we've got any voltage getting through to the board. See if we can do this without getting in the way of the meter. Okay, yeah, we got power through to the board. So if we've got power through to the board, there's not a lot else I can check. There's a bit of swarf across there. But I don't think that was doing anything. I suppose I could put some power onto the motor just to make sure the motor runs. If it's one of those Ob chips, circuit on board chips. So there's nothing I can look at there. So we want about two volts. Okay. So nothing wrong with the motor and we're getting power to the board. I really can't go any further than that. So that's it. We're stuck. I'm just trying one of the controllers again, just off the screen. Just trying to shine it. Nothing's happening. So there we go. Don't buy infrared.
powered toys without the controllers. No doubt I can convert it if I really wanted to. It's only going to go forwards and backwards, but I suppose Bart Simpson's a bit of fun. I'll think about that.